Hola, bonjour, ciao, and hello from Miami, Florida. Um, today is December 14th, and it is Monday, and this is our Easy One class. Um, on Saturday, I, I think I mentioned, um, well, I, the other, I guess it was on Saturday. Friday. Yeah, you on mentioned Friday, it, yeah. I mentioned um, that I was trying to get my blood pressure down and that I had gotten it down to uh, 130, but then um, the next day, every time I took it, it was uh, 124 over 70, 120 over 75, and 120 over 70. So it's coming down. And, uh, and so I'm working on that. But Friday, I uh, was working in the yard, and then Saturday, I think I mentioned that I was having this allergic reaction to something. And it was just on my arms and my inner thighs. And uh, Saturday night, uh, it just got worse. And I um, was in bed and I started having chills and my arms were red. But when I went to touch them, and I guess I mean, you can probably still see some of it, right? I don't know if you can see it, but it's like white here and then still there's still some red there. But it was so swollen that it just felt like bumps all over, all over my legs. It spread into my shoulders, my chest, everything. And um, there was something out in the yard. And so I thought that it was maybe poison oak. And I went out and I had Tom check and we still weren't sure. And I don't think that that's poison oak. But I finally had to break down and, and go to um, a walk-in emergency uh, clinic and you're like nervous about about doing this because of the pandemic and everything. And so we have one within walking distance if we really wanted to take a long walk. But um, we went and I was just for people who even who live in the roads, uh, if you're on, that uh, it was incredible. I went in, they before you, as soon as you step in, there's a thing to take your temperature. Um, and then you walk to the desk and everything is sanitized. The pens are all sanitized. You have to fill out your forms. But in the little waiting room, they have a plastic partition on the side of you and one in the front of you. And so it's pretty, pretty protected. But you still, you know, you still get nervous and everything. So I, I went in and of course my blood pressure went up because I was like, uh, you know, I'm really nervous about what's wrong with me because this is really, really painful. And it wasn't, it just didn't itch, it just burned like someone was holding a match to me. And so um, I met with the nurse and I met with the doctor and he said um, that something, that I had this allergic reaction to something in the yard, it could be a bug bite, it could have been um, bugs that I couldn't even see while I was working because I was on the ground and that um, I ended up having to get a steroid shot mixed with something else. And then I have to take um, uh, Benadryl and... Um, Antibiotics. No, the other thing, the antacid. I have to take Benadryl with um, an antacid and then I have antibiotics for five days. But as soon as I did that, it started to get better and now it's I mean, it just, I okay. don't feel... Yeah, it. You, mentioned that you mentioned the roads. And it's worth mentioning that you are not the only person in the roads who has had this issue. Yes, my neighbor, uh, two doors down, um, he, he had the same thing on his arm. From He has a yard like ours with a lot of plants. And um, <clears throat> they... She and when I mentioned it to her, because she I was outside and she just happened to walk by, and she said, "Well, she had told him what he did is he called in to um, his insurance to find out what doctor he could have a Zoom call with, and he showed it to the doctor, yeah. and the doctor uh, gave ordered a, a cream for him. But in my case, it was so systemic because I had gone too long. I had gone three days. So when something like this happens, all right. The important message here, though, is." If you're in the roads right now and you have a lot of plants in your yard, be careful. Be very careful and be careful digging around in the dirt uh, without protection because there is a critter out there that you can't see that will make your life miserable. Yeah, and it actually, I had gloves that covered my hands, so I had nothing on my hands. Um, and 
my arm, I had a t-shirt on and my arms uh, were exposed so that's where I got it first um, but then oh it was just believe me you just you don't want this to happen so say so, the thing um, yeah and I have to say the disclaimer yeah. <laughs> okay um, whenever you choose to exercise in any exercise program it's important that you consult with your physician first by participating in this online class you assume all dangerous hazards and risks of such participation. Some of the exercises demonstrated by the instructors can be physically demanding, and if you are unable to safely perform these exercises, please modify them or choose a different set of exercises. I wore this shirt mainly because it says that I am plant strong, and I think I wasn't strong against plants. And I didn't eat that much, it's from the steroids. <laughs> Monday morning. We're back to our Christmas program again.
Okay, let's do our taps. Ready? Tap to the corner. We're going to go all the way around to the side.
Take your elbow, drop it down, and just push your hand up like this. Down we go. Take your elbow, point it down towards your knee. Up we go, touch right there, and over, stretch. And the other side, over, and stretch. Push your hand down, lift up. Down and up. One more. Okay, great. Let's get a chair and have a seat. is you want to push your butt forward in the chair till you're only sitting on half the chair. Make sure your knees are straight forward and your toes are pointed straight forward. And put your hands right on your knees and turn them over like this and up we come. Let's do one more. Then we're going to work back, okay? Back here. Back we go. And then back. Way back. Now bring your hands right up and press them right against your chest like this with your fingers up. We're going to rotate like that and go straight out. Okay, we're going to work our way forward, two at a time. Straight forward. Do that one more time and hold it there and then use your swimming motion back like this. Go ahead and put your hands together and up we go. One more time, and then we're going to take and make a circular motion like this. Put your hands together, and out we go. And this time we're going to hold our hands up and open like this. Back and down. Now, move your fingers up and down like that. Really loosen them up. And take your thumb and rotate like that. Take your thumb and press it against your index finger. And then go all the way, all the fingers. Press them tight. Now, just take your fingers together and just push down like that. Up we go. And down. We're going to do one more. Up. Out. And make your fingers tight like this. Make like a claw. Rotate it around. Rotate it back. Relax. Up we come. And down. Drop your hands down. Shake your hands out. Push your hands going back. And one more time. And 
Rest. Okay. We're going to do our shoulder work now, and we're going to change our uh, uh, our some of our exercise around to get more rotation in the shoulder. So many people have shoulder problems as they get past the age of 40. So we're going to try to address them. Most of those can be eliminated through certain types of exercise and stretching. I'll take you. Want to try to stay away from it if you can. The shots and surgery. Now, you have to have it. You have to have it. But a lot of times, a lot of these problems, most of the time, these problems can be solved through some sort of rehabilitation. So here we go. We're going to start with our regular one, which we start right here and push right straight down. Now, take the hand and make a circle like this. Ooh. What do you think? And hold it right there and just bring it down and up we go. Now, take your arm and push it right out like that. Now, bring it up like this, and we're going to bring the elbow back, and then all the way over. Back, over. Back, over. One more. And now, just take your arm and go straight up. One, two, three, four. We'll do one more. Okay, great, huh? Did you like it? Okay, we'll do the other side. Ready? Straight up. 
Mahabha. And palm down. Okay, shake your arms out again, and let's lift up like this. One more. Okay, great. Huh? Let's stand up and do our hip work, hip and leg work. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Do our lifts. One, two, three, four. Now we come. One, two, three, four. And then all the way over. One, two, three, four. Swing it to the front. Keep your legs straight. Now we come. And then out. Back we come and cross. And into the front, again. Put your toe like this, and we're gonna lift up and make a circle and put your heel down. Bring it back, up. This time, hold it there. Keep your legs straight with your toe back, and up we go. One, two, three, Four, bring it over. One, two, three, four, and then out. One, two, three, four. Now put your foot right here. We'll do our side. One, two, three, four. Point and around we go. Great, let's go on the other side. Ready? Here we go. One, two, three, four. Now we come. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. On your front, keep your legs straight like this with toe pointing down. One, two, three, four. One more. Okay, bring it right in front and we'll do a curve up and put your heel down and back. One more. Now hold it right there, keep your legs straight and up you go. One, two, three, four. One. Here, one, two, three, 
Four. Put your foot right here. Up we go. Point and around we go. Okay, let's go to the back of our chair. And we're going to do our hip rotation from the front. So, we're going to lift our knee up and around we go. Go back the other way. Okay. Put your toe down and around we go. And back we go. Okay, put your toe down, squish some grapes. And let's do the other side. Here we go. Round we go. And then back. Make your circle on the floor. And back we go. Put your foot right here. Squish your grip. Okay, now. Set your heel down and then just let your, your foot flop around like that. And the other side. You can give the elves a break. You can make it in the shot. You can't put it on your sleigh. You know me so well. Okay, up we go. And then hold it right there. Bend your knees slightly. And up we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, and ten. Bring your chair back to you a little bit. We're going to pull our toes up now. Ready? Here we go. One, two, she likes this one. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten. If you can't do that one, keep trying because eventually you will be able to bring those toes up. You'll stretch the back of the leg out. And that's what it's all about. Okay, let's have a seat. Go ahead and get your weights. Okay. What we're going to do. First, go right down the end of your chair and stick your leg out straight with your toe back, all right? Now what we're going to do is just push the toe down like this and bring it back. Down, back, down, back, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine and ten. On the other side. Here we go. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay, great. Go ahead and pick up your weight. We'll do our stretch down, okay? Here we go. Okay, we 
We sure I'll go forward. A very good exercise. Again, with the shoulders. One more. Huh? Okay, great. Now just hold your weights down like this. Push your shoulders back and go up. Okay, bring them up here, and we're going to exercise the biceps. Up we go. Remember, remember our other classes, keep the weight right down on your fingertips and roll it up like that. So we'll go slow to make sure we do this as wide as we can, as perfect as we can get it. One more. Okay, now, hold your weight right on your knee like this and take the opposite one, put your elbow right on the weight and hold it straight up and down like that. Now we go. Two more. On the other side, right there, and now we go. Okay, last one. Great, okay? Put it right on the hip, right here, and just slide it forward. Great, right. okay, let's stand up. We're gonna do our circle. Big one. Slide down. 
hold them right there, and we're going to flip them up. <laughs> okay, turn them over, and up we come. One more. Back here, push back. And swing in the front. Bring it right here and just up we go. Down here, lift up. One more. And then right here, last one. Okay, go ahead and put your weights down. Okay, here we go. Let's do our shifts. One more. Okay, this time, pull your heel up, push your hand down. Your hand up. Push it forward. Push it forward. Pull your toe back. Push down. And the other side. Push right on down. Bring your hands up. Move your fingers. And do a touch. Bend your knees, swing it down, put your palms together. Touch your knee with your hand and drape your arm over. Bring your arm around, stretch it over. Stretch your arm up like this. <laughs> Down we go. Up. One more. Over. Over. Out the back. And that's it. Easy one for today. Yes, in our 1130 class, Harder, but if this was easy for you, you might want to try that. And be sure and tell me all your.